tonight here on my Klein. I'm going to show off my Roberto Alomar PC cards binder and top loader showcase. So let's get on with it. He played from 1988 to 2004. It's about 17 seasons. Played for eight teams. I believe he uh, came, he chose the Toronto Blue Jays as the a Hall of Famer. Of course, he also played for Baltimore, Cleveland, San Diego, Chicago White Sox, New York Mets. Only one year that he did not wear number 12, and that was with Arizona. I don't have that card of him. He was a gold glove winner between 1990 and 2001, with the exception of 1997. He did not win a gold glove. But of course, he was an all star between those years. He's in Cooperstown, by the way. So I'm not going to say too much more. There, there's his brother, Sandy Alomar. How cool is that? Also play with the Tampa Bay Rays. There's the A2 AL All-Star and the AL Playoffs. Oops, I showed that one. You get to see it again one final time. I think that was Ruben Sierra. Quote me if I'm wrong. There's Kenny Lofton, another player I used to PC. He's the four diamonds. I will show off a halftime pack break shortly. Of course, he'd been the honor roll so many times. There's the King B disc there. And the Craft Single Superstars. Oh, I did put this little cut up index card there so it could hold the mini because I'll show it this way all right that's the end of the binder part and just a few moments we'll show off the pack my choice, and then we'll do the top loaders, second half. All right, welcome to my halftime pack break. I'm going to show 1992 Pinnacle Series 2. We'll see what I get. Hold on a second. Here we go. Jacob Brunfield. Shout out to the zombie collector. He collects Cincinnati Reds. Dave Nilsson, rookie prospect. Matt Stairs, another rookie prospect. 
Sean Hare, rookie prospect. Wow. Now this is four cards in a row. And Rod Beck. Brett Saberhagen. Gerald Young. Mike Bordick. Craig Leppertz. Kenny Rogers. Daryl Boston. Raphael Belliard. Eric Anthony. Mario Duncan. Charles Nagy. And Dave Martinez. All right, so that's the end of the halftime pack break. And I will show off my top loaders and right after this. Now on to the top loader version. I'm doing this on the bed. This is the only spot I can do this. So I'm getting the sniffles here. So I'm not going to say too much here, although his value of his cards hasn't really risen. And no, I don't think this would count as me being a super collector of Roberto Alomar. But it's fairly close. Dream Team Gold. There's a Gold Rush. Gold Medallion. Hands of Gold. Team Pinnacle, along with Craig Biggio. I love the naturals there. Pacific Espanol. This is the only one I have him in the Arizona Diamondbacks. There's a sample. I think that's front and the back. I think that was the only year that score did its sample cards. The one with Craig Biggio again and two other players. There's one with Molitor, Alderud, of course Alomar. Diamond Kings. Now, he didn't make a, that much impact in Team 2000. More like Team 1990. Goal Predictor. Score Rules. Tops 50th Anniversary. Here's a mini opening day. Robbie Alomar, the, the short print there. There we go. You saw something like that one, but that one was a sample. This one's not. The diamond giveaway insert is the rookie Procter and Gamble, the rookies Cooperstown card, all time stat nineteen ninety eight and uh, MLB All-Star Game. Well, these were numbered. Yes, they were numbered to $39.99. To Grit. People like love these gloves. That's why he was a gold glover. 
These were hard to find and if you find them in packs. Great rookie. Tops gold. This is before cell phones were used. They used walkie talkies. Pacific needs bring these back. More uh, holographic action there. Here's number 12. Bound for Glory. Denny's. It's easier doing it this way, but can't have the light turned on. These are like 1 in 36 random packs. These are numbered to 9,000. Milestones. Magnetic field. Top glove. There's him stealing the base. One of 474 bases he stole in his career. Collection All Star I love this Pinnacle Museum collection here. There's the museum collection there. There's the gold. Love that one. Uh, the commemorative 1993 World Series patch and the only double jersey cuts to 125. Sorry, no autos of him. All right, I hope you like this showcase. You should probably won't see this again. So that's it and that's all. Sorry for my sniffling. Thank you for watching my line here on the Global Satellite Network.